Hey, what's going on, YouTubers? My name is Dom. I am a video guy out of the Central Valley of California, and I'm going to start doing a series of videos on equipment that I use because people ask, and I'm going to give my opinions and stuff like that. So I'm going to start off with my newest, uh, my newest guy right here. It is the Black Magic Video Assist. Um, it is a badass five-inch screen. Right now, it's taking input from the 4K protection camera um, via SDI. This thing does SDI and cross converts to HDMI out for 495 bucks. I'm just saying, and it records, and it records. Here's the issue with it right now. Out of the box, I haven't really took it on a shoot shoot yet. I'm gonna do that this Saturday, but. Here's the issue. It is supposed to trigger. When you push record, especially with the Blackmagic cameras, it is supposed to start recording on this. The problem is with the 4K camera, there's two settings right here. One is time code, one is H or one is just regular H SDI. So right now I have a set for time code. So when I push record, Nothing happens. You see, I don't know if you see down here, but my guy right here is recording. Up here, there's no recording. There's nothing going on. Change this to SDI and record, and nothing's happening. Nothing, or er, this thing is recording right here. Wait, hold on. My bad. My bad. Now it's recording, and this is not still. With the 4K, it doesn't record. With the 2K, the 2.5K that I have up there, it will only record in, in uh, time code mode. Um, I let Blackmagic know this a couple days ago, and they pretty much, for the whole time, was calling me a liar. Till yesterday, when I actually had somebody go and test it, they got back on the line with me and was like, oh, we see exactly what you're talking about. Our bad. We didn't know this. Blah, 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 blah. So the engineers are supposed to come up with some kind of firmware fix to fix that issue. That is one issue. The next issue, and I don't, because I don't like, I'm not, a, I'm not a full frame guy, so I don't have a Mark III. But I do have two 60Ds up there. And when I plug those guys into it, they don't trigger it either. Granted, the 60D doesn't have a clean output. But when you push record on your 60D, this screen goes black, completely black until you stop recording. So, you know, those are a couple of issues. Other than that, this thing is badass. It seems to be, I don't know, I guess, I, I don't know, I, I'm going to test the battery a little bit better, but it seems that one LPE6 battery, one of the Canon batteries, will run it for about two hours without recording. I'm going to find out this weekend exactly what's up. I gotta, I'm going to bring like five batteries with me and do that. So, I just want to get this video out. I know it's kind of crappy footage, but you know what? It's about the product and not about how cool the camera that I'm shooting on looks or some shit like that. I don't know. Anyways, whatever. I'm not going to do intros or anything like that. I'm just going to talk about my stuff. So I just wanted to get this out. Oh, I put another video out before just kind of going through it, and I got a question or like two questions. One is peaking meters and stuff like that and, and the other is lag there are no peaking meters all you have is this histi right here and that's it all your peaking and stuff will come from the screen or from your camera yourself itself but if you make that come through your SDI and then you want to record you're gonna record exactly exactly what your SDI is is putting out so I suggest you just leave that off clean output because it, 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 it's going to record what it sees. Um, as far as lag goes, check it out. Well, let's see if I can do this real quick. Uh, right here. So let me pan down real quick. So there's that screen and there's that screen. Beep, 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 beep. One, one, one. So what I've seen is the uh, the monitor is as fast as the camera. I don't know if that helps, but I'm going to do a series of videos 
going over all my gear that I use. And then I hope it helps some people. So until, until the next video, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys later.